Meghan Markle and Prince Harry have been careful to keep details surrounding their son private, but the mystery of baby Archie's godmother has finally been solved, according to royal correspondent Katie Nichol. Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor's godmother has been revealed with one huge giveaway at Meghan Markle's clothing line launch, claimed Katie Nichol. The royal correspondent said the godmother's identity has been kept very, very quiet. Ms. Nichol told Entertainment Tonight, I was there at the launch and spotted in the audience Isabel May, who is in fact Archie's godmother although that's been kept very, very quiet. She's a great friend of the Duchess and of course she would have known all about this launch. And Miss Hananu had a front row seat. Referring to Meghan Markle's new clothing line, Ms. Nichol added, I can report that the leather is butter soft, there's a beautiful tote bag that John Lewis have produced. For every tote bag sold they will donate one to Smart Works, it's a like for a like basis. I have to say, really great quality, really great colors, it's a capsule piece that consists of a white shirt that's been designed by her best friend Miss Hanamu. There's a black tailored suit that Jigsaw have made, co-designed with the Duchess. A tote bag which John Lewis has produced, which has actually sold out. Isabel May, 40 and former director of communications for Burberry, was selected as a godmother to baby Archie, according to Vanity Fair. Ms. May was introduced to Meghan Markle through a mutual friend and Soho House director, Marcus Anderson. A source told the Mail on Sunday, while they keep their relationship very quiet, Izzy is one of Meghan's closest and dearest friends and she values her friendship so very much. She helped Meghan adjust to lift in London when she moved here, and Meghan relied on her a lot. They totally support each other and, like any other female friends, enjoy social activities together. Meanwhile, Meghan Markle ended her maternity leave last Thursday by launching her own high street clothing line to help women get back into the workplace. The outfits will be sold at Jigsaw, John Lewis and Partners, Marks and Spencer, as well as her designer friend Miss Hananu, who is credited with introducing Meghan Markle to Prince Harry. Meghan Markle announced the project while she was guest editing September's issue of British Vogue. The Duchess appeared at the event wearing a pair of stunning butterfly earrings which once belonged to Princess Diana. Meghan Markle wrote in Vogue, The reason I was drawn to Smart Works is that it reframes the idea of charity as community, which, for me, is incredibly important, it's a network of women supporting and empowering other women in their professional pursuits. The workwear includes a shirt, trousers, blazer, dress, and bag. Meghan privately visited Smart Works several times before being named as its royal patron in January. Smart Works has helped more than 11,000 women and aims to dress 3,500 this year across their two London offices, along with their other bases in Edinburgh, Manchester, Reading, Birmingham, and Newcastle. It has a team of 300 trained volunteers and helps long-term unemployed and vulnerable women regain the skills, confidence, and tools to succeed at job interviews, return to employment and transform their lives. For every item bought, one will be donated to the charity which Meghan Markle became the patron of earlier this year. Buckingham Palace described Meghan's confidant as the women's wear designer who pioneered the capsule wardrobe. Meghan Markle has finally revealed her son Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor's godmother with a huge clue. When the Duke and Duchess of Sussex christened their son in a small private ceremony, their royal highnesses kept the details to a painstaking minimum. Only a handful of members from the British royal family were in attendance, Prince William and Kate Middleton chose to attend without their children Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis, and Meghan's mother Doria Ragland appeared to be the only person from Meghan's side of the family at the event. So far, the identities of baby Archie's godparents have been kept private, however, at Meghan's recent clothing line launch, royal correspondent Katie Nichol spotted another guest that she believes is the godmother. I was there at the launch and spotted in the audience Isabel May who is, in fact, Archie's godmother although that's been kept very, very quiet, Nicole told Entertainment Tonight. She's a great friend of the Duchess and of course she would have known all about this launch. And Miss Hananu had a front row seat. According to Vanity Fair, Isabel, 
the former director of communications for Burberry, was chosen as the godmother to baby Archie. The 40-year-old was introduced to the Duchess of Sussex through a mutual friend and Soho House director Marcus Anderson. While they keep their relationship very quiet, Izzy is one of Meghan's closest and dearest friends and she values her friendship so very much, a source told the Mail on Sunday. She helped Meghan adjust to lift in London when she moved here, and Meghan relied on her a lot. They totally support each other and, like any other female friends, enjoy social activities together. Meghan's clothing line launch marked the end of her maternity leave. The line will help women get back into the workplace through working with smart works. According to Express, the outfits will be sold at Jigsaw, John Lewis and Partners, Marks and Spencer, as well as her designer friend Miss Hananu, who reportedly introduced Meghan to Prince Harry. Nickel also discussed the clothing line with Entertainment Tonight, reporting that leather is butter soft, there's a beautiful tote bag that John Lewis have produced. For every tote bag sold they will donate one to Smart Works, it's a like for a like basis. I have to say, really great quality, really great colors, it's a capsule piece that consists of a white shirt that's been designed by her best friend Miss Hananu. There's a black tailored suit that Jigsaw have made, co-designed with the Duchess. A tote bag which John Lewis has produced, which has actually sold out.